In this video we're going to look at audio and what you can do with it. Now you might find when you make a video that includes an audio track, here we've got the roller coaster audio track and also a music track, that they're kind of on top of each other and it sounds like a bit of a mess like this. That means you can't really hear what's going on with the music. Hopefully by now you understand that using this mute button on the end means you can switch the audio on one of the tracks off. So therefore you don't actually get the uh, roller coaster themes in this video playing at the same time as the music track. Now, another thing we can do, we've got a, a text to speech the file tallest, over here. The tallest, fastest roller coaster on the east coast. That you might want to use in your project. So you can add more tracks on this side just by right clicking on the music track and go insert audio track. In this case you can do just the same by inserting a video track. Now what you can do is you can the drag that into here so we're using it in our project and then you get something like this the tallest fastest roller coaster on the east coast but again you might find that the music drowns out the uh, speech somewhat you could switch it off but we don't want the music we just want it to fade out so we're going to look at the volume and you can do that by showing keyframes here now if we look down at the bottom of the screen you'll see that we've got a line there to show the volume. What we can do is we can click to add a keyframe, that's where it's going to start fading out. We can add another one there because we're then going to drag that one down. We can then go to the end, add another one there and another one there. Once you've added those keyframes you can drag them around the screen like that to make the volume go a little bit quieter when your text clips on and as you can see on there it's going to start coming back up after the text clip finishes so let's see what that one does the tallest fastest roller coaster on the east coast so we get the music fading out and then fading back in. If you're not happy with the way you've done it, because it starts a bit early maybe, you can just move that up to there and just move the uh, keyframes around until you've got something that you're happy with. So let's try that one again. The tallest, fastest roller coaster on the East Coast. So hopefully that will show you how to fade music in and out and you can use that in your project to make sure your speech is nice and clear when you listen to it.